What's going on, Chad? My name's Kyle. I just wanted to reach out and make you a video that can bring you and your business some value. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can personally optimize your website to where you can drive in more traffic and generate more leads for your business. So I have three tips I want to share with you today. My first tip is the importance of content and keywords. Now, Google doesn't care about how awesome websites look. They care about what kind of content's on the page. And Google likes to see a lot of content. And the websites that have the most content are going to be the ones that have the most authority on that topic. So I recommend that you have at least 1,500 words of content on your home page. And, then, and the most important reason to have 1,500 words of content on your home page is because you need to have buyer intent keywords inside your content. That way when Google goes through and scans your page, they can find these keywords and they can rank you accordingly in the Google search engine. Now this tool here is called AREFs. It is a paid tool and it buys data from Google. And one of the features is, is it allows us to search for these buyer intent keywords. So I just looked up keywords as a, an electrician in Kansas City. And these are just some examples that you can put inside your content that you could potentially be found for. So you have electrician Kansas City is being searched 350 times a month. Electrician Kansas City Mo 200 times a month. You have Kansas City Electrician 90 times a month. I mean, and then you even have like your electrician services, Kansas City. You have your electrician contractors, Kansas City. Your residential electrician, commercial electrician. So there's all sorts of keywords that you can find put inside your content that you can be found for. You can find keywords for all your services that you provide and your service areas as well. One other tip you can do with these keywords is making sure that all your pictures are saved correctly. Right now when Google goes and scans your page, they see it saved as... A Porter's Electrical, which is perfect. You know, you want branding. Branding is, is awesome. So you want to save it as your business name, and then you want to put a buyer intent keyword behind your business name. So you want to save it as Porter's Electrical Company, uh, Electric Electricians Kansas City, or whatever keyword it is that you're trying to be ranked for at Google. Now, my second tip for you is backlinks, and backlinks are just as important as content and keywords. It's what, backlinks is what gives your website power, and it's what drives it to the top of the organic section. And backlinks are links throughout the web that when clicked on brings the user back to your website. It's almost like having a popularity contest and the person with the most backlinks wins. However, Google is now leaning more towards quality versus quantity. So they want to see backlinks that are relevant to you. So they want to see these backlinks coming from, say, other electrical websites or home improvement websites that have links linking people back to your website. Now, Eris also lets us see what's going on behind the scenes of websites. And I do want to mention there are free tools that you can use. If you Google Backlink Checker or Keyword Finder, you can find the free tools you need to be able to do this yourself. So right now, Porter's Electrical website, you have a URL rating, uh, no data, that tells us how powerful the site is. A domain rating of 1.4, it's how trustworthy the website is. Zero traffic coming onto the website each month. Google's not finding any keywords. You have one referring domain giving you a total of one backlink. Now these backlinks here is what gives your website your power and your trust. And you want these two numbers as high as possible and you want them as close together as possible as well. You want to shoot for a ratio of one. So I just pulled up the Google search bar and I looked for an electrician in Kansas City. And this is Mr. Sparky. I'm sure you know exactly who they are. They're located all over the country. So I looked up what their numbers, what they're doing in Kansas, so Kansas City. So they have a URL of 28, the power, domain rating of 23, the trust factor. They have over 3,700 people coming onto their website each month. They're being found for 5,600 keywords. They have 439 referring domains, giving them a total of 1,360 backlinks. Now, if these backlinks here are good enough to rank this website to the top of Google, it's good enough to do the same for yours as long as you have your content and keywords in order. And this is something you can do with all of your top competitors. You can get all your top comp competitors backlinks and you can get them linking back to you. You just go to the referring domains. Each and every one of these websites here has a link linking people back to their website. And you can do the same with yours. Just go into each individual site. Some you just might have to create a profile and you can add your website that way. Others, you might have to go to the contact us, email the owner, and they might hit you back with a small fee to be able to advertise on their website. Now, my last tip for you is get to the top spot in the Google Map Pack. That's this area here. It's one of the best spots to be in. You know, 40% of the, uh, the searches on Google click inside this Google Map Pack. So it has tons of search traffic. So how can you take this top spot here? You need more citations than your competition has. And all a citation is is your business name, your business address, and your business phone number listed in directories throughout the web. 
Some examples of a directory would be places like Yelp, White Pages, Yellow Pages, Better Business Bureau, even social media is considered a directory nowadays. So, Chad, I, I hope this video was helpful. You know, just a quick recap. You know, put 1,500 words of content on your home page with those buyer intent keywords so Google can find you. And get all the backlinks your, your top competition has and get them linking back to you. And finally, keep adding your business name, your business address, and your business phone number listed all across your internet and more directories than your competition has. If you follow these three tips, you will generate more traffic to your website and you will generate more leads for your business. Again, I do hope the video is helpful. If you have any questions, you're more than welcome to reach out. Not, have an awesome day. Thank you for watching.